In this video, I'll compare Windows 11 Home with Windows 11 Pro. My name is Amim and this channel is all about showing you how to become an IT pro really fast. So let's get started. Upgrading from Windows 11 Home to Windows 11 Pro cost $99, but is it worth the extra money? Let's address the elephant in the room first. Microsoft has launched Windows 11 with many new and exciting features like snap layouts, multiple desktops, Microsoft Teams, touch pen voice experience, widgets, and gaming features like Auto HDR. And you will get all these features either you are using Windows 11 Home or Pro. Both these versions require the same system requirements, but when it comes to the upper limits for hardware upgradability, Windows 11 Home can support a maximum of 1 CPU with 64 cores and 128 GB of RAM. On the other side, Windows 11 Pro can support a maximum of 2 CPUs with 128 cores and 2 TB of RAM. Now, let's see what you get more with Windows 11 Pro. In Windows 11 Pro, you get Windows Sandbox. Windows Sandbox provides a lightweight desktop environment to run applications in isolation safety. Software installed inside the Windows Sandbox environment runs separately from the host machine. A sandbox is temporary. When it's closed, all the software and files and the state are deleted. In Windows 11 Pro, you get Hyper-V. It creates virtual machines on x86 and x64 systems running Windows. Hyper-V works the same as Oracle VirtualBox and VMware. Windows 11 Pro allows you to use remote desktop connection both as client and host. While in Windows 11 Home, you can only use the remote desktop connection as a client. Remote desktop connection works the same as Team Viewer. With Windows 11 Pro, you can use BitLocker device encryption that is designed to protect data by providing encryption for entire volumes. Windows 11 Pro also has additional features like Azure Active Directory, Windows Information Protection, Mobile Device Management MDM, Group Policy, Enterprise State Roaming with Azure, Assigned Access, Dynamic Provisioning, Windows Update for Business, and Kiosk Mode. If you don't know about these features, then most probably you don't need them. If I conclude this video, you don't need Windows 11 Pro if you are a regular PC user. But Windows 11 Pro is the best option for businesses and enterprises as it provides the features and security they need. That's it for this video and I hope now you have a clear understanding of the differences between Windows 11 Home and Windows 11 Pro. Are you upgrading to Windows 11 Pro? Please let us know in the comments below. Please leave a like and subscribe to our channel and hit the bell. I'll see you in the next video.